My name is Erin Daly from Roper Mountain Science Center, and today I'm going to show you something cool you can do at home um, with tape to kind of check out static electricity. When we talk about static electricity, we're talking about something you may have seen before when you take clothes out of the dryer and they're all sort of sticking to each other. Um, and there's other places you might have seen it too, but basically it's the idea that um, when you have things kind of rubbing against each other, sometimes there can be a buildup of positive and negative charges. So, the way we're going to do this is, with your tape, you're also going to need a surface that you do not care about. Um, so I'm using a cardboard box. Um, if you do this on your table, it can sometimes pull the surface off of the table. So be super careful with that, and only do it on stuff you don't really mind if it gets messed up a little bit. Okay, so I'm pulling off a big piece of tape, and then I'm going to fold it over a little edge so I can pull it up off of this quickly. And I'm going to mush it down really good on my box. And I'm going to get another one. And they're basically both tape, and they're both on the same surface. So I'm going to expect them to both get the same charge. And in science, when two things have the same charge, they behave in a very specific way. So let's see what that way is. I'm going to pull them both up at the same time. Okay. Problem is my surface pulls up too. Hold on. You may need a buddy to help you hold down your surface. Okay, good. So if you'll notice, my two pieces of tape, they are not liking each other. They are repel because they have the same charge. And in science, the like charge is repel. So they're sort of dancing around each other. Now, we can actually cause them to have opposite charges using the same two pieces of tape. So this time, I've got, I'm putting them on top of each other, not next to each other. So this second one is going directly on top of the first one. I'm going to mush them down really good. And then this time I'm going to pull them up together as one. And then, now that they're in the air, I'm going to pull them apart from each other. This time, this time, you'll notice that they are actually attracted to each other because now they have opposite charges. And in science, opposite charges attract. So you can see that that's kind of a cool thing that you can do at home if you have tape and if you have a surface. Um, and there are other things you could do too. You could kind of test different substances, but again, don't pull it off of anything that you're attached to because the tape is surprisingly sticky. Um, so, so have a good time experimenting, happy sciencing, Bye.